a rare planetary alignment is about to happen, and this is how you can see it. Seeing the planets of the solar system align in a neat line is one of many awe-inspiring star stargazers experience we can get. And this month you could have a chance to see it with your own eyes. From the middle of the month, when viewed from the northern hemisphere, you'll be able to see Saturn, Mars, Venus, and Jupiter all lined up in an almost perfect planetary alignment in the pre-dawn sky. The alignment starts to form from around April 17, but will be at its most viewable on the morning of April 20th. To see the alignment from the U.S., you'll need to get up before sunrise on the morning of April 20th and look towards the east, of course, before the sun rises. There on the horizon, provided viewing conditions are good, cloudless skies that is, you should be able to make out all four planets aligned in a celestial row, although, as some have pointed out, Jupiter's proximity to the horizon could make it a bit harder to make out. So close to the horizon on the left, you would see Jupiter, then Venus, then Mars, then Saturn uh, diagonally in a straight line. So as uh, keen stargazers likely already know, Saturn, Mars, and Venus have actually been clustering together since late March, but it will not be until mid-April that Jupiter will join the party as well. A few days later, around April 23rd, the alignment is said to become even more spectacular with the moon lining up to join the party at the end of that line. So you'd have Jupiter, Venus, Mars, Saturn, and the moon. So this is what it would look like. Jupiter, Venus, Mars, Saturn, and the moon. Almost a straight line. It's a little bit curved in this way. And so this is what we would see before sunrise. So a few days later, we said around April 23rd, the alignment is set to become even more spectacular, the moon lining up to join all these other planets. When heavenly bodies align like this, it happens only in Earth's skies, of course. Viewed from a different location in space, the position of each planet would be completely different. The solar system is effectively flat, with each planet orbiting the sun within the same plane, so any perceived alignment is just a trick of perspective, depending on where and when you are. Nevertheless, planetary alignments are an amazing thing to witness, and they don't happen very often, at least not with alignments involving uh, as many planets as this. And that said, this month's alignment, while rare itself, is really just an appetizer for an even more credible event set to take place in June of this year. On June 24th, all of the other planets of the solar system Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, and Uranus will join together in an even grander planetary alignment, although you probably need binoculars or a telescope to see Neptune and Uranus. This alignment will also stretch out over a greater section of the sky, making it harder to discern or even photograph. Despite these challenges, major planetary alignments like this one visible to the human eye are very, very, and very, very rare and have only occurred three times since 2005, so you don't want to miss this. We don't always get this opportunity, astronomer, educator, Michelle Nichols from Chicago's Adler Planetary told Life Science. Sometimes it's one or two in the sky, a lot of times it's none. This was published by originally Science Alert, it's on Collective Spark. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support, this is by Peter Dockrell. My Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.